Hi, I'm Antonia, and not too long ago I went on an amazing healing and vision quest to Peru. And we visited many sites like Machu Picchu, as you see here. It's a beautiful, breathtaking place. It's surreal, actually. When you're there, you, you can't even believe that the place exists, even though you're standing right there, because the beauty of it is just so magnificent. And really, one trip to Peru is not enough. And that's why I'm going back in October of 2007. You're more than welcome to come with me. I'm taking a small group, not only to tour some of these sites, but we'll also be working with a shaman. If Peru is some place you've wanted to go, if you've wanted to go to Machu Picchu, if you've wanted to fly over the Nazca Lines, if you've wanted to work with shamans or experience a healing or vision quest, this is the time. This is the place. You can go to HealingSpirit.com and look at the itinerary, which by the way was planned by the shaman who's going to lead us on the quest. This is a sacred rock at Machu Picchu. And when you stand on it, they say that you're supposed to be able to see and hear into other dimensions. And these are some of the llamas there that walk around freely. So you can touch them. This one came over to us while we were meditating. This is one of the mountain shamans that we worked with. This is one of the jungle shamans. We're on our way to the Amazon jungle here. And this is Don Victor, who is the shaman that we're going to work with. He's a powerful and he's very very genuinely interested in your enlightenment. And that's one of the reasons I loved him so much. We'll be with him for two weeks, meditating, touring the sites, doing energy work, healing work, plant medicine, sweat lodge. This is sunset the first day we arrived in the jungle. And the jungle really is an amazing place. When we worked in the jungle, we actually, there were several shamans there, Don Victor, the other shaman you saw in the boat, and some others. And they incorporate plant medicine into some of their work. Don Victor, the one we'll be working with, he uses San Pedro while the other ones they used ayahuasca which have different effects on different people. I talk more about my experience in our Healing Vision Quest Yahoo group which you can join for free at HealingSpirit.com. You can ask questions, you can share your own experiences and you can also meet other people who are going on this trip. Now this is the hummingbird. This is one of the etchings, one of the petroglyphs at Nazca. These are aerial photos of the ground. These petroglyphs were made thousands of years ago. And we'll be flying over those when we go back in October. I didn't get a chance to go last time. And I'm very excited about this part of the trip because when I was a teenager, I actually had a vision of these. And when I found out that these were real things, and that they were in Peru. I really wanted to go there and fly over them. And this time we'll get to do that. Peru's very colorful as you can see too. It's very vibrant, very alive. So it's a really nice mix of energies there, a nice blend of energies. You see some great architecture there, both by man and by God. <laughs> Those mountains are truly majestic, let me tell you. And it's so serene out there. You know, you can really connect with yourself, with nature, with spirit, with energy. You can really get a different view of the world, a different sense of the world, a different connection with the world. You know, a lot of those people, what I found amazing, some of the Indians that live in Peru have been almost untouched by modern civilization. We went to a few places where people didn't even speak Spanish. They still speak their original native tongue. And I, I love that. I thought it was fascinating. And there aren't a lot of places that you can go that haven't been touched in some way by modern civilization. But many of these places we went to are just as pure as they'd always been.
It's such a beautiful place. So I hope you'll join us in October. Going to Machu Picchu and flying over Nazca and other places and experiencing shamanism and plant medicine. You can just go to HealingSpirit.com and look up the itinerary and join our little discussion group where we're sharing our experiences. You can get to know people before you actually go.